Okay, this video is to show you how to make a nonlinear PowerPoint. As you can see, I have my PowerPoint done. This is the way I choose to do it. Doesn't mean that you have to make your whole PowerPoint. You can do it each slide as you create it. I just chose to make my full PowerPoint first. This is the easiest way that I find to do it. I go to the first slide that I want linked to my home page. I click on the title, I highlight it, I right click, copy, go to my home page, and I paste it. Then I can move, this is going to be my hyperlink, I can move it anywhere I want. I'm going to put it there for now. I'm going to go to page two, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to click on the title, I'm going to highlight it, I'm going to right click, copy, go to the home page, right click, paste drag it to where I want it. Then I'm going to go to the last page, click on the title, I'm going to highlight it, I'm going to right click, I'm going to copy, go to the home page, right click, paste, and drag it to where I want it. Now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to hyperlink these titles. So we again are going to highlight them, right click, and right here it says hyperlink. So I'm going to click on hyperlink and I want to go to a place in this document. So I want to make sure that this box is clicked on and I can see all my titles. So I want to go to page one, then I click OK. Then I go to the next one. I highlight it, I right click, I click on hyperlink, make sure this place in the document is clicked, page two, okay, last page three, I'm going to highlight it, I'm going to right click, hyperlink, page three, okay. Then I want to create a way to get back to this home page when I have clicked out to the different slides. So I'm going to click on page one. I'm going to go into Insert, Shapes, down at the bottom are Action Buttons. What's nice about using an Action Button is, I'm going to use this Home button, you'll see when I click on it, I get a little cross. I'm going to click, I'm going to drag till I get the size I want, and right away the menu box comes up that asks me what I want to do. And I want to hyperlink this Action Button to the first slide. I can hyperlink it almost anywhere, but I want to hyperlink it back to the first slide. Okay. Then I'm going to go to page two and I'm going to go insert, shapes, action button, click and drag. It's already back to the first slide. Okay. And last, insert, shapes, action button, click and drag and OK. Now to see if it works I'm going to click on slideshow, play from the beginning. Here's my home page and what I mean over here this is a good place to put your links is on the home page. If I click on page one it takes me to page one. I click on my home button takes me back. Page two click on the home button takes me back and page three and I click on the home button and it takes me back. Pretty simple. And that is how you add hyperlinks to create a nonlinear PowerPoint.